Hello guys, this is going to be a quick tip to show you how you can set deadlines for your projects in Todoist. Because I always wanted to do that, but I couldn't figure out a way until recently where I figured out how you can create sections in Todoist. And I thought it would be a cool idea if you can just make that just for deadlines because that's not part of what Todoist uh, do. You can assign deadlines to tasks, but not on a project level. So what you would do is you just go to any project you want to uh, assign a deadline to, create a new task. I'm just going to go ahead and create that at the top. Okay, so, all right. I'm just going to go ahead and start with a star space and we'll type deadline. Now any task you start with a star is a section and that's going to be a task uh, that cannot be completed. So I'm just going to go ahead and hit enter for now, okay. And um, I'm going to go ahead and edit this task and assign a due date to it. All right. And I also have a label called deadline. I'm going to show you why in a while. And we'll save that. So now if you just come here and see that this project, while you can have the deadline in the comment section, you still, you still want to be reminded about your deadlines. So for this specific project, at the very top, I have a task which cannot be completed. And as you can see here, it doesn't count towards the total number of tasks for this project. So it's not a task, actually. It's, some, it's, it's a summary of inform or information or whatever, whatever you want to call it. But the interesting thing is when the time comes for this task or section to be within the seven days or today, it will show there. So you will know that the deadline has approached, but it will not count toward the total number of tasks you have for a project, okay? Now, if you want to take this one step further, I will go ahead and edit that. And I'd make the deadline in bold. And to do that, you just encounter any word you want to make in bold with two stars in front of it into, I think they're called asterisk, after them. And I'm going to save that. And what this does is it makes it bold, bolded. And for some reason, I've lost the, um, the label. So I'm just going to put it back. OK, so now you can see how you can set a deadline for a project. You can do the same for another one. OK, but another cool tip I want to show you is that you can just come here to labels. And uh, where it says deadlines, OK, I have a couple because I've been working on a couple of these. So I'm just going to go ahead and change the date for tomorrow. As you can see, this started to show here, but it's not going to show on the project level. So anyway, under deadline, you can see that we have two deadlines, one for tomorrow for this project and one for 18th for this second project. So what you can do is just when you click that deadline, click the three dots and say pin to start and just say OK. All right. Now, if you go to today, for example, I'm just going to close to do this for just a second. If you want to take a look at your deadlines, you just hit on start and you see this. You just click it and you see all your deadlines. OK. And if you don't like these flipping task thing, you can just come here and say um, remove the lifestyle off. And uh, I'm just going to also resize it to medium. Because with medium, it says the word deadline appears. So when you start, you can quickly access your deadlines from here. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed it.